This is the quickest I have ever worked out who is responsible for the mystery in any of the new adventures of Mary Kate and Ashley books. This is cheerleading tattletale. As you can see, this is unfortunately not in the best condition. Um, and that's the back of the book for anybody who is interested. And this is one of, I think, three that are set at cheerleading camp. Could be four. Excuse my cat who's uh, wandering around. I'm using her bed fleece as a backdrop. And it turns out that they're having a cheer Olympics and they are the Eagles and they're competing against the Pirates at uh, who are from a, a nearby cheer camp. And it turns out that the Pirates have the almost exact same cheers and exact same dance moves and cheer moves as the Eagles. And Mary Kate and Ashley take it upon themselves to try and find out how on earth that could possibly be. And as I said, I worked out who was responsible very, very early because of a detail that was given that felt really random and out of place. And I thought, okay, well, that must be relevant. That's the person. But I could never work out why. So I kind of, <laughs> Medora, I kind of get half a point for working out who it was, but I don't deserve the full, the full glory because I couldn't actually work out why. But I think it's a, a well-written narrative. It definitely kept me guessing because I couldn't work out the why, even though I was pretty confident about the who. There's a lot of uh, cheerleading vocabulary in this. I think it, it explains things quite clearly. There are a few things that I don't understand. There are a few like you know, term bits of terminology that I didn't get. For example, Mary Kate um, does a pike jump, which I know I know what that is. It's described very briefly, but there's something else called a something eagle a split eagle i don't know what that is um so there are some things that i think they could have explained a little bit better so i could picture things more clearly but generally it's quite well written we have as always oh this one's got the photo cards in actually we just have a, a reproduction of the front we have clue with a pom-pom um as always pretty large font size short chapters perfect for the target audience Definitely one that I really enjoyed and I'm quite pleased with.